and welcome to our session. Let us discuss the following question. The question says, show that the function given by fx equals to log x divided by x has maximum at x equals to e. Let's now begin with the solution. We are given that fx is equal to log x divided by x. Differentiating both sides with respect to x, we get f dash x equals to x into derivative of log x that is 1 by x minus log x into derivative of x that is 1 divided by x square. And this is equal to 1 minus log x divided by x square. For maximum or minimum value, we will put f dash x as 0. So, we have 1 minus log x divided by x square equals to 0. This implies 1 minus log x is equal to 0. This implies log x is equal to 1. And this implies x is equal to e. Now we will find second derivative that is f double dash x. And this is equal to derivative of 1 minus log x divided by x square. By using quotient rule, derivative of 1 minus log x divided by x square is equal to x square into derivative of 1 minus log x that is minus 1 divided by x minus 1 minus log x into derivative of x square that is 2x divided by square of x square that is x to the power 4. Now this is equal to minus x minus 2x plus 2x log x divided by x to the power 4. This is equal to minus 3x plus 2x log x divided by x to the power 4. Now we will check the sign of f double dash x at x equals to e. Now at x equals to e, f double dash x is equal to minus 3e plus 2e log e divided by e to the power 4. This is equal to minus e divided by e to the power 4 and this is equal to minus 1 by e to the power 3. And this is less than 0. So f double dash x is less than 0. My second derivative test We can say that fx is maximum at x equals to e. So we have shown that fx equals to log x divided by x has maximum at x equals to e. So this completes the session. Bye and take care.